guys, it's me, Tara, with Pepper Scale. Welcome to my sizzle reel, where I give you a hot sauce review in three minutes or less. Today, we're talking torchbearer sauces, honey badger, honey mustard. Scorpion and Carolina Reapers dance around with this sauce and add a respectable heat without taking away that honey mustard flavor. Torchbearer sauces always have a ton of flavor and a decent kick, so let's dive into what makes their honey mustard sauce so special. The ingredients are apple cider vinegar, scorpion pepper, honey, distilled white vinegar, water, canola oil, brown sugar, mustard powder, Carolina Reaper pepper, white sugar, cayenne pepper powder, black pepper, turmeric, mustard seed, granulated garlic, salt, garlic. So you'll get that honey mustard taste, but it'll be on the back end, right after those peppers hit you with their heat and you get a nice tang from that apple cider vinegar right at the top. This also carries a bit of sweetness from the honey and the brown sugar, but you won't be able to taste that till you're a few bites in if you can handle the heat. So with that long list of ingredients, the scorpion peppers are actually the highlight here, a little bit more than the honey mustard. So before you get to taste all the delicious flavors, those scorpion peppers will dominate those taste buds due to the heat level. After that, you'll get the honey mustard flavor, which has a really nice sweetness to it, but it's not too sweet. They didn't overwhelm it with too much honey or too much sugar. You'll be able to taste the warmness of that brown sugar before the classic spices kick in. This has a full great list of ingredients, which you will be able to taste after a few bites in, but the real star of the show here is those scorpion peppers. So for those hot sauce seekers, they'll be able to probably use this throughout their meal, but I would still label this a medium to high heat level. I can use about three tablespoons of this with my meal. Any more than that, my tongue will be burning a little bit more than I would prefer. And the heat comes in quick. It'll hit you mid bite and woo, you'll be able to feel it. And the heat lingers around for a couple of minutes until it dissipates and then it'll just leave you nice and warm. So this is great with anything that you put honey mustard on, like chicken nuggets or sandwiches. I also added a tablespoon of this to my honey mustard sauce and it added just the right amount of kick that I was looking for. And I think this also works really well with any potato dishes and was so delicious on my carne asada tacos. So the honey mustard flavor makes this a very inviting sauce, but the kick on it will leave it more as a sauce to be desired by the heat seekers, because I think it has a little bit too much of a kick to be a family friendly hot sauce. And if you wanna knock down the Scorpion and Carolina Reaper's heat level, mix this into a larger base and you'll still be able to experience that kick, but it just won't be as strong. I also love that Torchbearer was started by three guys who just happened to have a lot of extra habaneros in their backyard. So they decided to start a hot sauce company. I love all of their labels. Each and every hot sauce comes with a different character on the label. So not only can you collect these for the taste, but once they're all lined up on your shelf as a nice little collection, it looks like a comic book strip. What more could you want? Thanks for watching guys. To read the rest of my review, go to pepperscale.com and I will see you on my next sizzle reel.